Gentlemen, the Amazing Digital Circus, episode three. Oh, snap. Turn that volume up. Turn that volume up. Turn that volume up. Here we go. Here we go. Is it? I can't hold it any longer. Sure you can. We can't die from oxygen deprivation, remember? But it still feels like I'm gonna die. Try not thinking about it. Or you could toughen up. I want to see what your funny cartoon body does. Hey, take it easy. Oh, take it easy. That's you. All right. Here I go. Oh, so they literally cannot die. Even though it feels like she's gonna die, she can't die. She just, she just can't die. Hey, there's something new. Okay, we're getting red. Oh, orange. Yellow. She literally cannot die. Whoa, look, now she's turning blue. She was already blue. Huh. Guess the hue shift just gets faster. Why am I the one doing this? Why not one of you guys? Because something different happens with each person. For instance, Kinger starts glowing, Ragatha's hair noodles stick up, Kay. Gangle's mask starts spinning, Kay. and Zubal turns straight. My limbs straighten up and fuck off. What about you? He refuses to show us because he's a coward. I want to keep the mystery alive. What do you, the viewers, think it is? I'm not going to say what, I, what just came to my mind. Why is everybody just standing around when there's adventure to be had? I'm not going to say it. Today's adventure is the mystery of Mildenhall. I'm not going to say it. That's right. This big spooky mansion has been rumored to be filled to the brim with paranormal activity. It's up to you to solve the house's deep mysteries and capture all the ghoulish ghost activity you can. Oh, spooky. First time ever, you can. Where's Zubal? I made this adventure really cool and uh, mature, just for them. Mature. What? The NPCs <laughs> aren't going to become self-aware in this one, right? How should I know? I'm not the boss. Oh, wait, yes, I am. <laughs> anyway, everybody into the fractal noise. It's adventuring time. Yo, I love this. Oh, this place is spooky. I wonder how hard Kane's gonna go with the scare factor. I hope this adventure doesn't end up being another horrible nightmare. I'm not really a fan of horror. Oh, and I, I am. Don't really handle jump scares. Oh, I do. <laughs> ah, come on, that wasn't even scary. What? You scared of the vacuum cleaner too? Hey, be nice to her. Luigi's mansion. A rough couple of days. Her and everyone else. Right, Gangle? Does anybody hear that? <laughs> Hi, I'm Ghostly. What? And I'll be your guide today. Why won't they go back in? <laughs> I remember my first wild take. I don't know why they're not retracting, though. That didn't happen for me. Before you continue on your adventure, you have to choose which door you're going to go through. Left. The door on the left is the normal door. Rated wow for all Right, answers. right. The door on the right. Right door, right door, right door. door. Right door. door. Right door. For mature Zoobles only. Right door. It's up to you to do <laughs> Why the jacks? What? I thought we were supposed to capture all the ghosts. Uh, which door should we choose? Hmm, not sure. Let's try this out. Don't worry, Gangle, I'll get it for you. <laughs> oh, that's the scary door. Zubo, come on out. I just want to talk to you. Oh, for her okay. eyes just. Could you have done that the whole time? Zubal, I, I just want to get to the bottom of why you keep skipping all my amazing adventures. You could end up really hurting Bubbles' feelings. <sighs> Bubbles' feelings? E enough about Bubbles' feelings. How about your feelings? What in the world? So, what's on your mind, Zubal? I would rather not. <laughs> That's hilarious. Go on. No, I mean... I've already told you what my problem is. You just never remember because 
Oh, never mind. Because My why? Mind is a beeswax polished coconut. Nothing ever escapes these cakes. So what can I do to make my adventures more appealing to you? See, this is exactly what I'm talking about. Why can't he what remember? What I'm thinking about is your adventures. It has nothing to do with the adventures. It's more just ugh, forget it. You're probably not even listening. Zool, look at this cool bee I drew. Bro, he's so mean. He's so me. I feel I feel that. Oh, her eyes are back. Where are we? Oh, that's no. Rawr. Who is that? I wonder what this thing is. My name is Baron Theodore Mildenhall. Hunting has been a hobby of mine for as long as I can remember. Although one could say it eventually became more of an obsession. The creature you see before you is one I've been pursuing for years. Not quite a man, but not quite an animal. Something unholy, something evil. I took it upon myself to spend every waking moment doing all I could to protect my family from the creature. Hoping that when I'd eventually killed it, I would be freed from this awful feeling, this inescapable dread. I was wrong. You know, I'm starting to think. I'm scared, chat. How about we try to find a way back up to the others? I'm scared, chat. Okay, cool. That's great. I love these adventures. We could always ride this thing up. It's locked. It's locked, of course. It's locked. I love that it's locked. Tuesday to Noodle Arms. Although I had shot the creature multiple times in its vitals and severed its head to keep as a prize on my wall. My troubles were just beginning. I took my eyes off the body for what felt like only a minute. And when I looked back, the body was gone. The creature was not Oh, so it's still alive! Would be back to reclaim what I'd taken from it. It's head! If anyone is listening to this, all I ask of you is one thing. Do not let the head out of your sight. You have been warned. Uh-oh! This is some rather inconvenient lore placement. I got it! And this is some rather inconvenient darkness. Uh, what was that? Was that you? No. Oh, wait. You mean me grabbing you right now? Yeah, that was me. Is this your hand? Uh, that's my eye. Yes, but which eye? I really don't think that matters. Will you stop touching my eye? Oh, yeah, sorry. Uh, what happened? I just remembered a really funny joke. Uh, you, why did you scream then? Maybe it wasn't actually that funny. Oh my god. I think we should hold on to each other and slowly make our way back into the trophy room. Uh, sounds fine to me. Bro, there's gonna be another eye that pops up. What was that? What's what? That? It's probably just magnets. Or a boat. A boat? Or whatever the case. I think we should be Bro, there's going to be another eye that pops up. I... Okay, yeah, I agree. You know, you're really hit and miss with these things sometimes. Wait. There's a fly in here. Don't you think that's making a lot of noise? Oh, God, there is a fly. And... Gotcha! I think I got him. I can't see my hands. I'm sorry. Could you speak up? I couldn't quite make that out. Tommy, I think this might be the creature from the tapes.
take off, cause this boat is going up! Huh? It's not up. It's not up at all! Why are we going up? Ah! Bro, that was way I scarier than I thought it was gonna be. Torture my guests! Any torment I inflict is one Also, it's kind of like Roblox doors. It looks like ambush. That was ambush. About that. I really couldn't give less of a crap about the adventure. It even sounded that like ambush. Problem, I'm trying my best to remember, but both you and my brain won't tell me. It's me, remember? I don't like myself. I hate this body. I hate all these stupid removable pieces. I just want to find something that feels good. Oh, yeah, now I remember why I couldn't remember. It's because that problem is already solved. Simply swap out your undesirable Zubal parts for better ones. I've been trying to find parts I like since the day I got here. So, back to the adventures. Forget it. Forget it? Just forget it. Forget what? Kane. Nobody likes your stupid adventures. Ha <laughs> ha, good one, Zubal. Ragatha's just too nice to say anything. Jax just likes to f*** with everybody. Gangle's too shy to speak up. Kinger's insane. And, and Pomni, she looks traumatized every time she comes back from one. Oh, Zubal, Zubal, Zubal. Making adventures is my art. It's all I exist to do. All I'm good at. And, uh... What you're saying could imply that I'm bad at the only thing I'm good at, and that... <laughs> that'd be... Uh, whose therapy session is this again? Oh yeah! We need to get to the bottom of your behavioral issues! I'm Bro, lore! And you're gonna say Call the map, hat, lore! That comes to your mind. God, where are we now? I'm not sure. A seller of some kind. Is Kane abstracting? I don't know. Things have gotten far worse than I could ever have imagined. My paranoia had driven me to the point where I was no longer the protector my wife and theoretical children needed. Jumping at every shadow, every noise. I ended up shooting the love of my life, mistaking her for the creature. It's... Ironic, isn't it? In my attempts to protect her, I ended up becoming the monster myself. Now I wait down in my cellar, no longer having anything to protect but my That's own him. soul. If nothing else, I will slay the beast that took everything from me. How's about we take his gun? Yeah, sounds good to me. Yo, he's going to grab it. Okay, I won't. Looks like we've got two shots. Let's make them count. Uh, yeah. So he did he never used it. He never killed the monster. Stay behind. Just leave it to me. I can handle this. Well, that wasn't so bad. Which is what I would be saying if I didn't know that the creature was actually one of God's angels. What? And anyone who brings harm to it will be dragged down into the cold, spiraling pits of hell where my soul is. Wait! I apologize, dear listener, but I need a living host in order to escape the Hall of the Damned. And your bodies will be my only means of doing so. Now wait, how did he record this if he was in hell? I hope you're ready. Because the next breath you take down there will be Wait, your last, what? And your bodies will belong to me. Let go of me! 
Wait, what? Wait. Mm, good tea. Sorry again about your husband killing you and everything. Oh, you know how men are. Always having the silliest priorities. <laughs> oh, that's his wife. Don't I know it. <laughs> if your friends see him, I only hope he doesn't bore them to death with his endless monologues. That man could turn a 57 second story into a Greek tragedy. I'll be sure to ask them next time I see him. Thanks again for the tea. I had a really nice time here. <laughs> Don't mention it. Feel free to visit any time. Bro, I had one of those wagons as a kid. I love those wagons. Congratulations, my little ironclad waffle cones. You've taken the pacifist route. And you should be proud of what good people you are. Unfortunately, we still need to wait until your other teammates finish their adventure before I can grant you permission to leave. I wonder how long that'll be. Bro. Bro. Really Bro. What you'd think hell would be. We are literally in hell right now. Hell! Of course I'd be in hell. How could I not be in literal hell right now? Just try to stay calm. I'm sure Kane included a way to escape. Hold on. Wait, what the wait, 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 does that does this mean that map hat was right? Let me try something. Hey, there's actually a staircase down there. It could be a way out. Maybe it'll work for us since we still have our bodies. Though I'm worried about what that tape said earlier. I'm just gonna try going fast. Wait, Pommy! <laughs> Souls are attracted to living things. Just want a vessel to be able to. Kinger lore? Man. Seven years of computer science for this, huh? huh. Why? More lore. Every day I spend here is one nightmare after the next. I knew it would end up like this. He, he just wants me to suffer. I really am in hell. Don't say that. You're not in. Yes, we are technically and forget about that how about we just relax for a bit while nothing's chasing us <laughs> huh? so kinger had to like help like program all this right it was my fault we went down this path wasn't it i'm really sorry for that why have you been acting so different lately. <laughs> I have, haven't I? I'm normally not too good with memories. But being surrounded by So was he like an employee? Brings me back to a certain time. Flashback! Right after my wife had had abstracted. I don't recall the exact string of events, but we both ended up in the fort together. And it was dark. Darkness seemed to calm her down a bit. The harsh, jagged edges smoothed out, and she didn't seem aggravated anymore. She wasn't the same as before, but she was calm enough to touch one last time before she got sent to the cellar. I'm always taken back to that moment when engulfed in darkness. Chat, why are you saying yeah? Life? Like here in the circus? Yeah. She was funny, creative, really into entomology. What's entomology? I used to hate bugs, but she somehow got me to like them. It's not the most cheerful memory, but... Study of insects! One I at least have control over. 
I know how it can feel in this circus. Sometimes it all just feels pointless. Yeah. But it's not. Not if you have people who care about you. Good memories can do a lot. Hold on to them. And cherish the people around you. You never know when they'll be gone. Bro, this guy deep. In this world, the worst thing you can do is make someone think they're not wanted or loved. I'm glad you're here with me. Bro, that guy's so deep. Oh my god. You know, I've been thinking about that last tape. He said, the next breath you take down there will be your last. Maybe we can get through if we don't breathe. I'm not very good at holding my breath. Oh, there's new merch. Well, I'm about to get that. How about we try not thinking about it? We leave and we go back to the circus. You're just gonna go back to being crazy. You're not gonna remember any of this, are you? Don't worry about me. As long as you remember it, things will be okay. You're very strong, Pommy. And I know you'll be able to get through this. Just hold on to me. We'll get through it together. You ready? Care. They did it. Are you guys okay? Was it scary? I'm fine, actually. What happened up here? Uh, don't worry about that. Tommy was very brave. At least I think she was. Were you? Something like that. Hey, Ragatha. Yeah? I just want to say thanks for always being concerned about me. I feel like through everything. I haven't really been appreciative enough about that. Uh, oh, thank you, Pommy. I just... Kree's sure getting emotional? It was a little emotional. We care about you. Did you remember to get my comedy mask? <laughs> and, and now I'm, I'm just starting to wonder if the Wild West was even a real direction at all. Whoopsie daisy, looks like everybody completed the adventure and they're coming home. Quick, pretend we weren't having a therapy session. Okay. Welcome back, my meowing milkmaids. What? Don't ever call us that again. <laughs> so what was it like being stuck with the nutcase? It wasn't that bad, actually. Dang. Dang, chat. That was a deep. That was that was that was that was uh that was deep. Oh my god. That was like I wasn't expecting that to like do that. Like uh, you know, like I was like geez. I, uh, uh man. Oh my god. Yo, they got the plushie. I gotta get that. I gotta get that. After credit scene. Good God. Oh my God. <laughs>